<laughs> My boy with it. He said, let's go. Bro. Who said, let's go? Let's go. I like you, nigga. You let somebody fuck your girlfriend. <laughs> let's go, dude. Whatever you want, David. I... She's all yours, man. Pussy's wet, bro. I... <laughs> You a frat boy? No. What college did you go to? ASU. Yes, Arizona State? Yes, sir. You a frat boy, nigga. That's... <laughs> you don't think so? Uh, no. I, I was never in a frat. That don't mean you're not a frat boy. <laughs> you got frat boy energy. You're grown with a backwards hat. <laughs> Just like this fag right here. Nigga. <laughs> Fucking backwards hat in the front. Look, like, take it. This motherfucker like an undercover cop, nigga. <laughs> you look like you go to black people and be like, you want to buy some reefer? <laughs> it's like, nigga, you the police, bitch. <laughs> Ain't nobody said reefer in 15 years. What do you do? Are you working at Tito's Vodka? Look at this nigga, fucking alcohol chef, nigga. <laughs> hey, bitch, I'm a five-star chef, ho. You should fuck with me. The shit I cook is intoxicating. What your boyfriend do? <laughs> You're a farmer? What type of farmer are you? Weed? So what, what do you grow in your greenhouse now? A spinach, nigga? Like, what? <laughs> Butter, lettuce, kale. You are gay, nigga. This is like, How's my little butter lettuce today? <laughs> Soon you'll be in Trader Joe's. <laughs> you probably like that dude from the Lord of the Rings. My precious. <laughs> my precious butter lettuce and kale. No pesticides on you, baby. What got you into greenhouse farming? <laughs> and no girls will fuck you, so you're like, let me. You got you married? Where's she at? What? You are her family, nigga. Once y'all get married, you're one. Her parents? She Mexican? Yeah. She big? Oh, is <laughs> like, yeah. Only Mexicans and black people take care of their family. Fucking. White folks put their parents in a nursing home quick. <laughs> Dad, I gotta live my life. <laughs> <laughs> fucking Nickelback's at Moody, man. I can't fucking. <laughs> How much your girlfriend weigh? 120? Oh, you got a skinny? Oh. He just looked like he would have one of them big, you know, fucking pupusa making bitches. You got a girlfriend? Yeah, I'm, yeah. I, 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 yeah, yeah. <laughs> you got. <laughs> this, I don't know if I trust this. You about to get married? Who gonna wear the dress? <laughs> you wearing the dress? Royal blue. Look, she picked it out. Oh, you did. You a crip? No. <laughs> what made you choose royal blue for your wedding tuxedo? It looked good. Like, it looked good. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> Queer eye for the straight guy. You know what I'm saying, man? <laughs> How long you and your girl been dating? Uh, we've known each other for 10 years. Been dating for five. Got a kid together. Got, just had a daughter. Oh, you black, bro. You got a baby mom, and nigga. You ain't married. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Get these hoes pregnant and then decide if you want to marry her. That's how it should be. Look, look at what type of mother she is. You don't even know what type of mother. She Mexican? What is she? You you left her alone with the baby? You know white women be going through shit. They'll they'll fucking kill that baby nigga. They'll, a fucking scene on a Lifetime movie. Oh man, I'm so sad. Where's my baby? I would have drowned him. <laughs> it's so weird that white people value their pets more than they value their kids. You ain't never heard of a white person drowning their dog, nigga. 
They be killing the fuck out of them babies. <laughs> A white person would kill a baby in a minute. They don't go. White men kill their wives and white women kill their babies. What's that bitch who drowned her babies and then put them in bed? That shit is crazy, man. Like, that's the only thing that scared me about white women. You know what I'm saying? But the th- I, I look at it as a positive if I'm not home. I'd be like, at least I ain't got to feed these motherfuckers no more. Kids are expensive. I got two of them, nigga. I got a three-year-old and an eight-year-old. My three-year-old can't read, but she know what the fuck a number one at Chick-fil-A is. (laughs) (laughs) Fuck that. (laughs) Number one, daddy, two Polynesians. (laughs) Hey, but you can't even read. How you know how to say Polynesian? (laughs) 